What is going on, everybody? Actually, some Flyers news, believe it or not. Not only did we re-sign someone like Robert Haig and bring him back on a very team-friendly contract, which is awesome to see, and trust me, that's a huge move. I mean, this is somebody who was leading the Flyers in the NHL and hits for quite some time throughout the season and just brings a, a, a type of physical game that you need to have in the NHL as a defenseman at this level. So not only was that huge, but our prospects right now, what they're doing and playing in this, this World Junior thing and Joel Farabee just lighting it up scoring goals I mean it's insane to watch and and seeing our prospects the games are on NHL Network it's cool to see you know these are all NHL prospects is to watch your players and to see these statistics that I'm about to read to you when it comes to NHL draft experts and the hockey news and sporting news NHL where the Flyers land in prospects is insane and I've been saying this for so long now our future is so bright and the plan that Ron Hextall put in place is really starting to move but the Flyers are leading the NHL in prospects like with the most prospects in the top 50 with four guys and these guys are literally going to change the Flyers organization moving forward. I really firmly do believe that. Our prospects as a whole are so legit and, and are at the top level of the NHL moving forward. It's going to be a couple years and all, but we have it in place. The, the prospects are there. And we're going to start to move year by year by year. I am telling you, it is the damn honest truth. Now let's take a look at number 19. Overall top 50 prospects. Number 19 is Joel Farabee, the selection of this past year's draft and he is a stud he will be entering his ncaa years coming up here after playing with team usa but he's lighting up this world junior showcase he's gonna tear it up at bu he's a stud and we select him in the first round this year and he is number 19 overall as prospects in the nhl at number two for us is carter hart at 34 i was actually surprised that he's this low because he is the promised land, but you got to factor in all the forwards, all the D. You know, it's tough to be a top, top player as a goaltender when you get compared to forwards and defense as a whole. It is. It's tough to do, but we all know he's the real sensation. He's the real promised land player. That if he's what needs to be successful for these for this run to make it what it is. We need a goaltender. We know the story of Philadelphia for how long now? We would never have goaltenders. We finally get Bob Roski wins the Vesna, but we move him on. Well, we move him on before he wins the Vesna, but still, I mean, come on. That's ridiculous. That should never happen. We need the goaltender. Carter Hart is the answer, and he is number 34 in the top 50. Number 37, Myers, right-handed defenseman. He can really play. He can move the puck well. He sees the ice very, very well. And then the last one is Morgan Frost, 43 overall prospect, and he, he played in the OHL. He is a fantastic player, and what I hope he ends up becoming is, you know, it, it's a it's a high reach, but a, a, a Konechny type player. I want to see him play the game like Konechny. I feel like he has that type of style of play that he can really bring it if he just steps it up a little bit, and it's going to take some progress for these guys, but these players are no joke. Yes, they're young. They are no joke, and they are going to be the future of this Flyers team. We have the legit prospects to move forward i'm telling you it's not crap it is serious and if you're not behind ron hextall and his plan and what the flyers are doing i'm telling you get on it get on it right now because it's gonna happen this team is serious this team's plan is so real it hurts and we have the cap space now and now we start to make these moves and then we start to hit the free agency market right we added JVR a little hefty that's fine we have the money let's go out and get these top players I'm telling you boys I'm telling you five year window Stanley Cup I know it's a little hefty you gotta give these prospects a little bit of time these prospects are legit we are young we are fast we have the speed we have the skill that's what you need in the NHL these days it's no more grind it's no more broad street bullies it's a new style of play and that's what we are building for and that's what these prospects are going to do for us in the future i guarantee it let me know your thoughts and opinions down below thank you so much for watching i will see you next time i'm thrilled trust the process with the flyers boys it's a thing i guarantee it it's a thing we trust the process with the sixers why can't we trust the process with the flyers we should they deserve it it's a lot closer than you expect it to be it's a lot closer than you think. I'm telling you, it's right around the corner. I can, I can smell it. I can absolutely smell it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you next time.